Hello everyone, Rigo Villa here. I'm one of the community managers on the Cisco Learning Network. And in this short video, we will walk you through the steps on how to book your Cisco written exams directly through your certification tracking system profile. Cisco simplified the scheduling process for written exams and created a one-stop shop for your exam scheduling needs. So this is what you'll see in this demonstration. And after the video, please leave a comment to let us know if this was helpful. And as always, please hop onto the Cisco Learning Network to connect with the community for help or guidance on how to prepare for your exams. And with that said, let's jump right into it. Welcome to this video tutorial of how to use the simple sign-on Cisco Certification Tracking System. Cisco has revamped its candidate certification experience with a new simple sign-on process that will provide you with access to all of your certification information from one convenient location. You will no longer need to create multiple profiles on different systems to manage your certification data. The Simple Sign-On Certification Tracking System will be the one-stop shop for certification and exam management. From this one location, you'll be able to update your profile, schedule, purchase, reschedule, or cancel written exam appointments, review testing history, review certification history, review test results, download score reports, transcripts, certificates, and logos, and receive personalized analysis announcement, articles, and discounts. If you're new to Cisco certifications, all you'll need to do is create a Cisco account, the process of which I'll walk you through. If you already have an existing profile, just log on to your profile and you'll have convenience to access and manage your certification journey from one location. Once you have decided that you would like to register for an upcoming Cisco certification exam, you can begin by going to cisco.com to create your Cisco account. This Cisco username and password you create will be the same credentials you use to log in to the certification tracker system. To begin creating an account, click on the Login button in the upper right hand corner of the page. Then you will be taken to this page. Here you can select the Create a New Account option below the Next button. This will take you to the Create Account page. In order to create an account, a candidate must use a legitimate email. We recommend that you use the email that you would like all of the notifications pertaining to your exam sent to, including testing appointments, confirmation emails, and testing appointment receipts. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'll go ahead and fill out this form with a valid example email and other information specifically for this demonstration. When I have finished filling out this information for my new account, I'll click Register. If you have successfully filled out all of the information correctly, you will be shown a window notifying you that a verification email has been sent to the email you entered for your new account. In order to complete the process of making your new Cisco account, please find the verification email in your inbox and click Verify. Once you have created your new Cisco account, we encourage you to become familiar with our certification and training web pages. All certification policies and recertification information can be found within our certification and training web pages. One of the easiest ways to learn more about any of the certifications Cisco offers is to view the certification path. Here, you will find the paths for entry, associate, professional, and expert level certifications. All certification exams fall in each of these paths. If you are ready to schedule an exam, choose a particular certification that you're interested in achieving, and the exam will be listed underneath it. One of our most popular exams is the CCNA. If I choose CCNA from this list, I will be taken to a page where I can learn more information about the CCNA certification. And if you're ready to take the CCNA exam, scroll down to this section and click the Schedule Exam button listed here. This will automatically navigate you to the simple sign-on Cisco certification tracking system where you can choose the details for your exam. But first, you'll need to log in with your Cisco account that you just created. This is the homepage of the Cisco certification tracking system. If you are a new candidate to the Cisco certifications program, you will automatically be prompted to fill in a few personal details to complete your candidate profile. This information is required in order to schedule your exam. By scrolling to the bottom of the My Information page, you will find an external IDs box. In this box, you will see a specific CSCO ID that has been assigned to you. This CSCO ID will be unique to you and your Cisco certification journey. It will be printed on all of your score reports and certifications. 
In the Addresses section, you will be required to fill in the address you would like to be associated with your account. Please note that this address will be the one Cisco uses to mail you the certifications that you earn. You will also be able to download PDF versions of your certification achievements. The information for the Settings section is also required. These settings will pertain to your email preferences, verifications about your certification preferences, as well as a few other questions that are important to answer to proceed with your account. To schedule an exam, click on the Schedule dropdown and select Schedule an Exam. Within this section, you'll also be able to view, cancel, or reschedule any upcoming testing appointments that you have. Any existing testing history that you have with our program will also be shown in this section, as well as any continuing education credits that you have earned toward a recertification. There is also an option to be able to view any certifications that you have earned. In this section, you will be able to see your current active or inactive statuses of your certifications, and you will be able to download a PDF for those certifications. Additionally, you will be able to view your existing NDA agreements with the certification program, download logos, certifications, and plaques. In the section below certifications, you will also be able to request additional transcripts and digital badges with our program. Once you're ready to schedule your exam, navigate to the Schedule an Exam option from the menu on the left below the Schedule dropdown. On this page, if you have any additional questions about the Cisco certification exam you have chosen, you will be able to navigate back to the pages detailing the information for each exam and certification track by selecting the Exam Topics button. If you would like to purchase a practice exam or any additional training products within the Cisco portfolio, select the Practice Exams button on the right. Once you're ready to schedule your exam, click this graphic. But first, notice the options further down the page. Below the Schedule Now exam graphic, you will see a section that displays any upcoming appointments that you have. Finally, at the bottom, you will find options to navigate back to the exam topics list, the practice exams, and to get connected with certification support. To schedule your exam, click on the graphic here. This will take you to a page that might appear familiar to those of you who have tested for Cisco certifications in the past. By clicking on View Exams, you will be able to find our entire catalog under Proctored Exams. Then, choose the exam that you would like to schedule. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'll go ahead and select the Cisco Certified Network Associate from the list. Then, choose how you would like to experience the exam by selecting either At a Test Center or Online at My Home or Office. For this demonstration, I'll select Add a Test Center. Each of these buttons will describe the requirements that you need to follow for these different testing experiences. Then, select Next in the bottom right corner. You must accept and agree to all of Cisco's testing policies and NDAs to proceed through the registration process. I'll select Yes and then click the Next button again in the bottom right corner. And on this page, I'll select Agree at the bottom. Next, you can select a test center. The address you entered into your profile information within the Certification Tracker Portal is automatically used to generate a list of test centers in your area that you can choose from. Because of this, you will not need to enter your area or time zone information. Once you have located the test center you would like to take your exam in, select the check mark on the left side and then select Next. Then, select a date and time at your preferred test center. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'll select this date and this time. When you are ready, click Book This Appointment. Next, verify that the information for the exam you would like to take is correct by reviewing the information on this screen. Then, select Proceed to Checkout in the bottom right corner. On the checkout page, you can choose to pay with a credit card, electronic check, or enter in a voucher or promo code if you have received one of these. All of the information you entered into your candidate profile page in the certification tracker is carried over to the payment section as well. Once you have completed filling out this information, select Next in the bottom right corner. Again, verify the exam, the date and time, and the location. If everything looks correct, select Submit Order in the bottom right corner to complete the transaction. 
Then, look for a notification at the top of the screen stating that an email confirmation has been sent to the email address you provided. If you would like to return to the Certification Tracker Portal system, select Return to Cert Tracker below the notification. Once back at the Certification Tracker Portal, you will be able to see that you have an upcoming exam by scrolling down. By hovering your cursor over the exam code, you will be able to see the name of the certification this exam is for. If you decide 24 hours before your certification appointment date that you would like to reschedule or cancel your exam, you can take those actions by selecting one of these options in the top right corner under the Upcoming Appointment box. For this demonstration, let's say that I have an unavoidable conflict scheduled for the same date and time of my exam, so I'll select Cancel. On this page, you will be able to review any of the information for your previously scheduled exam. If you are sure that you would like to cancel this appointment, scroll down to the Cancellation Policy and check I have read and agree to the Cisco Systems Inc. policies listed above. Then select Confirm Cancellation in the bottom right hand corner. You will see at the top of your window that your appointment has been cancelled and an email confirmation of the cancellation has been sent to the email address you previously provided. So if you navigate back to the Certification Tracker system by selecting Return to Cert Tracker, you will be able to see that there are no longer any upcoming appointments scheduled. Thank you for watching this tutorial video on how to use the Simple Sign-On Certification Tracker Portal. We wish you the best of luck. If you have any questions or would like any additional information about Cisco certifications, please visit www.cisco.com go certifications.